Welcome back to our next installment for Digital Lab Insights. Just our opportunity to share our experiences, our research and our insight into marketing, into digital business, into digital marketing techniques that are happening around the world. We have been talking a lot about mobile lately and we hope that this is going to add some value. The first um, aspect to, that we started dealing with when we started to see that mobile was shifting and changing so much was this concept of the Internet of Things. Now the Internet of Things essentially suggests that previously to, on the Internet, people spoke to people. They used the Internet to connect with each other. But now what we're seeing is, is that we're actually able to take technology that's of a high enough grade that can make decisions or, or run certain exercises or scripts across a particular action. So what we do is we now say we can take one device and get it to speak to another device on the internet. And if we can do that, we can start to firstly make ourselves more productive because we, can, we don't have to be doing the things these machines are doing for us. But secondly, we can start to gather data at a rate that is faster than we could gather it in a human context. Vodafone are currently doing a lot of work here with Venice, where they're using centralized systems and smartphone access and technology to be able to manage traffic better by getting uh, traffic meters, measuring up to a central database and being able to make decisions based on that, being able to manage uh, parking fines via your cell phone to be able to scan a code and be able to pay it electronically. There's a lot of this type of technology that makes it so much easier to manage things that are, are actually quite difficult to manage and involve a lot of manpower. And so at the end of the day, what we, what we need to start to say is, if this is what Vodafone can do with Venice inside smart city arrangements, what could we actually do by impacting the power of mobile, understanding the internet of things in our business structures to be able to offer a much better and a far more interesting product and service to our customers.